Hi Poo Poo's, Ness Poo Poo and Cups Tarot. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome to the Poo Poo's Trap. This is going to be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for your love life for September. Let's find out what the tea is. Universe, Spirits, and guys, what do Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus need to know about their love life for September? What do they need to know about their love life for September? Some of y'all could be closing y'all heart chakras. It could go both ways. Some of y'all could be closing y'all heart chakras, or some of y'all are opening up your heart chakra for somebody that is tickling your fancy. <laughs> y'all know I play too much. Ooh, suffering in silence. Why y'all in y'all head? Ooh, choose wisely. Okay, I'm going to take that. So we have the moon card here, the shadow card at the bottom of the deck. We have base chakra. Some of you guys need to check out base chakra because it could be blocked for you, okay? So we got suffering in silence and choose wisely. Okay. Some of y'all missing somebody? You can have options right now, but you feel like uh, it's not her. It's not him. I'm not making fun of y'all. I'm just playing. I'm just trying to get y'all to laugh. That's all. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. So under the moon card was emotional loss, mental conflict, and movement and decisions. Movement choices and decisions. So yeah, y'all got options. Um. Y'all got options, but I don't know. I don't. I don't think that y'all want them options some of y'all could just be sexually act active with these people and don't even really want them some of you guys could just be really really wanting the person or some of y'all want to go back to the person who y'all missing and want to have sex with that person just saying because that person made you happy universe spirits and guys clarify suffering in silence clarify suffering in silence please suffering and silence mm. yeah y'all want to come back with somebody some of y'all um could be missing somebody because a third party was involved you got a decision to make honey but some of y'all want to come back with somebody y'all want to come back and celebrate with somebody y'all want to re reconcile with somebody oh well, somebody want to reconcile with you. They trying to, somebody's trying to make a decision here. Tell me more about suffering in silence. So be able to cancel or Virgo. <sighs> trying to manifest them back. Somebody's trying to manifest somebody that walked away. Somebody walked away and didn't look back. Now they're single, which made them made them really, really sad. Or it could be you guys. Somebody moved forward and didn't look back. Yep, something ended between you and somebody, and somebody is missing somebody. Could have been some a, a lot of heartbreak, betrayal, backstabbing. Clarify, choose wisely. 
Ooh, the moon card again. So something is being hidden from you. Okay. We have the Six of Cups, Ten of Cups, and the uh, Ten of Wands. A lot of completion cards with number 10s. So this person is from your past. You could have had a family with this person. And now it's a burden not even having this person. It's a burden for you to even have options. You want this person from your past that made you happy. Or the person that you have a family with. But you don't see that happening. Clarify Bay Shark. Or somebody don't see it happening. Okay. Somebody nervous. <laughs> Very nervous. Somebody wants to apologize. Tell me more about base chakra. say somebody walked away didn't look back and somebody feel defeated now somebody feel defeated somebody could have been doing some real sneaky stuff and somebody walked away and didn't look back but somebody want to move forward again let me see something because i want to write down the title want to write it down because I'll be forgetting because I'll be having the perfect titles <laughs> in the middle of the readings. So, let's give you some guides. What other messages do you have for Capricorn for love for September? Ooh, some of y'all have been married to this person. Somebody is at somebody at a distance with distant horizon. Could have been married to this person with marriage. Somebody could have had a girlfriend on the side. Or could have been your girlfriend. Ooh, well, somebody juggling. I do see the three of cups. Could have been a third party. You know your story. Ooh, yeah. Somebody's all in their head with despair. One more card, please. So now y'all trying to focus on y'all work. Capricorn. So, so y'all, career focus, concern is at the bottom of the deck. Imprisonment. Somebody, see, somebody all in their head and they stuck. Y'all tied and y'all feel tied and bound to this person. Y'all want this person. Or it could be vice versa. It could be the uh, cross watcher who, who feel this way about you, Capricorn. So, take y'all resonate. Thank you. What I say, career, I mean, finances and careers, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So, y'all focusing on y'all finances because um, finances could be like really, you know, messed up right now. Or well, that's just getting you getting your mind off of this with this person. Well, I'll tell you, some of y'all could have been married to this person. Well, wedding, this situation involves marriage. Somebody was married. Or this somebody that you wanted to marry. Okay, okay. 
feel like y'all talking to people and y'all don't even like them. So, past life past life relationship you have known each other before that's why you're so connected to this person this person is a past life person trust the situation is calling for you to have faith so it's, it's a, you know it's a possibility this person could be coming back it's hidden from you you're not supposed to see it <laughs> it's probably a lesson for you or a lesson for the person the person not supposed to see if you coming back or not it might be a lesson Gemini. Be a Capricorn like yourself. Or it could be an Aquarius. So we have Sun and Aquarius number 11 opportunity. Readiness for change. So somebody wants some change because they miss somebody. But they don't know if they should, you know, stay or go. If they should stay or should they go? Should they come back or should they not come back? Moon and Gemini, number 15, indecision. Should I, should I stay or should I go? So let's see what, spirit has, what else Spirit has to say. Hey, hey. Be assertive. They're telling you to do. Mm. It's up to you. Forgiveness. The situation will improve. And yes. So you tell me what you take from them cards right here. If this person going to come back or not. But it's hidden from you. It's hidden. <laughs> what advice do you have for Capricorn? Y'all know I am crazy. What advice do you have for Capricorn when it comes to love for September or Universe Spirits and Clouds? Oh, something on my nose. Um, advice to do the old style. The old well, oh y'all. In the button. Ain't trying to flash nobody. Okay. Let's just see what the first card comes out. Thank you. Ready to love again. It's at the bottom of the deck. You heal from the past enough to open your heart to new love. Control issues. Utilize your God-given strength and power instead of fearing that other may, others may try to control you. Is that y'all being controlling? Or is it the person being controlled? Which one is it? Only you know. But it's telling somebody to stop being controlling. Okay, so that is all the messages that I have for you guys. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If it resonated, drop comments down in the comment section. You like to book a personal reading with me everything is down in the description box don't forget to hit the notification bell 
to get notified on when I upload new videos. I hope to see you guys soon, but you guys will only see me if you subscribe and hit the notification bell. Okay? So, love you guys, and talk to you later. Bye, poo-poos.